Blessings in Jesus, dear friends. This is James Jacob Prash from Moriel Ministries speaking to you from Galilee in Israel. We're in Israel at the moment, and we are finishing the last copy editing of our next book, No Bomb and Gilead. It's been in the works for a while. What really takes place? What really transpires after the rapture? You know, there's so many things people are saying today that have come along in recent years that are alien to what believers have traditionally believed. Some people are even saying that the rapture is going to herald in a great worldwide revival after the faithful church is removed, despite the fact that the book of Revelation tells us that men still did not repent of their wickedness. All kinds of things. What do the scriptures really tell us will take place after the rapture and resurrection after the parousia? You know, most of what the scriptures tell us, particularly the book of Revelation, shows us that once the faithful church is removed, and even to a degree before that, God begins to shift his salvific and prophetic purposes back to his ancient people, Israel and the Jews. Once the church is gone, Israel becomes his main focus again. This is not to say he will not be dealing with people from the Gentile nations, but the age of grace will be over, the age of the church will be over, and the time of the Gentiles will be coming to a close, and his focus goes back to dealing with Israel. We're in Israel at the moment, and we just want to take this brief opportunity to tell you about our upcoming UK conference on Israel and prophecy. On the 13th to the 15th of March in Warrington, in the north of England, near Manchester, near Liverpool, we will have a conference where I'll be joined by Pastor Menno Kalischer from Jerusalem. Menno is the pastor of one of the largest, maybe the largest, Jewish congregations of believers in Israel, certainly the largest in Jerusalem that is indigenous, that is Hebrew speaking mainly, and he'll be joining me once again. Menno is well known to many believers in, in America, Canada, but also in Britain. We've had him before. And we've had quite a response to his previous visits, so we've invited him again, and he'll be joining me. The subject of the conference this year will be, however, the Messianic movement, its history and its future, with particular reference to the body of Christ, the body of Messiah, the body of Yeshua here in Israel, from where I'm speaking to you now. The conference will again be in Warrington, England the 13th to the 15th of March, located at Daresbury Hotel and Conference Center, the Daresbury Hotel and Conference Center. Those wishing to book places, and it's a residential conference, is 07-894-862-590. The international code for Great Britain is, of course, double four four four. We have people coming from other countries, from Ireland and other countries in Europe, sometimes even further afield. But it will be our Northern English Conference on Israel and Prophecy this year, looking at the Messianic movement, its history and its future, with specific reference to Israel. Again, 13th of 15th to the 15th of March, at Desbury Hotel and Conference Center in Warrington, England, near Manchester, near Liverpool, near Chester. The phone number again, 07894-862-590. Beryl Hunter and Peter Hunter are handling the bookings as usual. We'd love to hear from you. Please join us and come here myself, but here, Brother and Pastor Menno Kalischer. You know, one of the things that happens is Many people put many things on the internet or at conference events speaking about Israel. What Moriel has tried to do is to give Israeli believers, Israeli pastors, a platform to speak for themselves firsthand. We want you to hear firsthand from Israeli pastors, Israeli messianic leaders, what God is actually doing in Israel. We think it's important that they have a platform and an opportunity to speak for themselves 
they can explain things better than other people and better than other people who are in the diaspora or outside of Israel. In fact, some of the people who come from Israel are not even Israelis. They're expatriates who go on a conference circuit outside of Israel. We don't want to be like that. We want to give the indigenous Israeli body of Christ an opportunity to speak for itself. And again, I'm honored to have my friend and our brother, Pastor Menno Kalischer, joining me the 13th to the 15th of March. Once again, 07-894-862-590. Please come and join us if you're able to. May the Lord bless you and keep you in Jesus. Adonai Yevarechem Vadon Yeshua. Todaraba. Thank you so much. Yeah.